Hello everybody, welcome back to Enderal episode 6. I'm Simuchi Amen here, and today we're back on Yelvin's journey through this wonderful, yet sometimes harsh world of Enderal. Now we are up here because I wanted to find a decent location to kind of do the intro, and I managed to find a strong box right here. So I thought that would be interesting to open. So, might as well try. See what we can get. We got a book about handicraft and element. Solism, which is pretty good. But anyways though. Just a quick reminder if it's been a while since you watched this episode, even though it should be out by it should be out already, but I, by the time I'm recording this video, Enderal episode 4 is out, episode 5 is pretty much gonna, is gonna be in the works immediately after this, and then I'm currently working on 6, but I'm gonna change up that pattern soon enough, with just finishing them up, and then I work on six, and then immediately I work on the next episode. That'll be better. So anyways, I learned two new things. Never mind, three new things. The first one is that... The waterfalls are still too high. I guess I can't win with some of these. The waterfalls are still way too loud. But still. Well, the first one that I learned is that there'll be more influences with choices because people can and will lie so I'm guessing there's gonna be some heavy role-playing aspects to that so that should make things a lot easier than people constantly telling the truth and things like that and second is that in the place called the Undercity, there's an underground arena where people fight, like, f to the death there. So, maybe that could be, a, like, an activity and I can partake in. And you guys can watch. That would definitely be interesting. Though. That's actually true. But more likely than not, rumors tend to be true in RPG games. Sometimes. But still! Anyways, we found something here. Uh, what's this? You know, I should probably just take the normal. Euro's house. An ice claw. Very funky. Nice. Uh, dang, I keep forgetting it's in food. Alright. But either way. Uh, Euro was the, uh... Hmm. There it is. No, not that one. So pretty much I have to find the year, the strong box which Euro drew into the senior's near his house and talk with Euro's childhood friend Alfred. Alright. It's been a while. Still. What the I should see what spells I have equipped. Okay, mystical sword, ghostly wolf. Are you alive? 
Okay. Just had to make sure. I won't. I mean, this looks like an interesting one. Hmm. Alright, that's the strong box you threw into the sea. You have three parts. Oh! This. Alright, I found the life box. I found his three life letters. Started new quest. Secrets. Ah! You egg! I was doing something! <laughs> I was reading! <laughs> Secrets. In Magister Yero's strong box, I found a key adorned with the Order's chest. Perhaps I can find the lock it opens. Find the use for the key in Yero's strong box. I'm curious if this fits with the new power. Because I think in the last episode, Taylor and I was like, alright, let me get the Net of Souls ability. Uh, no souls. Uh. <gasps> oh, that's not a s <clears throat> Dang, I got my hopes up for no reason. That's just a banner. I thought it was a ghost. Either way, I'm not in combat, so I might as well take a seat in this house. It's a carrot and some crusty bread. Alright, there should be some rats. I ain't taking no risk at getting diseases. <gasps> Ooh, a backpack. Wait, a backpack. Nice. Took me a bit to pick up on that, but it's like. Disciplines of magic entropy. Well, either way, I got a decent place to set up. Just chill for a bit. Oh yeah, there's more right up. I just want to sit down and take a, a nice break. But not yet. I found salt. That. Yeah. Oh. Probably some spider or something in here. Thought that was a demon for a minute. But still, found some pea weed. Turn of year, rotten garlic. Man, a lot of people are hitting the pea weed. I found next. Lantern. I might as well take the axe. I found another piece of the swashbuckler set. Hey, what happened to it? Oh, I already have it. From jewelry box. Which... <coughs> hmm. In which will I find something interesting in it? I 
found Light Mentor and a Silver Garden. They're decent stuff. Let's. Right. A broom. And a staff. Wait a second. Staff healing. Uh, let's see what that does exactly. Heals a friendly Tyree for 30 points of health. It's cool. But, anyways, I should probably. You're a seller. First, I should probably read Yerl's journals though before I dig any deeper into it. Yerl's diary, first page. Didn't know that, like, it'll automatically read the books for me in the voice of them. This is definitely interesting so far. I did not know it was going to be like red like this again. But, whew. Man, I'm just trying to get a little bit of insight into your... <laughs> hmm. So, I know it's maybe like an apprenticeship. And Sarah's like a childhood friend. And he's kind of sick of the daily grind. So it's like, we can do something more than this. I think it's going on to what Finn said earlier about, like, change, essentially. Where people tried to change... No, no, no. It was either... No, no, no. It wasn't Finn. It was Jesper who mentioned something about one to advance. Like, instead of just taking their place. So maybe this can just tie back to that. So let's read the second letter. Zero, I love you. 
That's not what happened to Sarah. Like I'm a bit confused with like how it's structured. I want to read. No, I. Right, I'm gonna go to immediately to the third one. It must have something happened with that. That was weird. Automatically saving. Finally, the third one. Sucks. That absolutely is devastating to hear though. It's like trying to do something good for the people and then it ends up turning everything to hell and making things worse. Where it's like, alright, here's food for the people once for a week. Literally, Sarah gets killed. And then it just starts, people start brawling and murdering each other. And it's like, And then it ends up getting revoked. So it's like, what's the purpose of this? It only caused suffering. When it meant to call, like help, some degree or form. That truly sucks. I'll see. Yeah. I want to find out what's in the cellar, though. Oh dang it! Can't. That really sucks, then. Now I got old sheriff or terminal. Now I got Alfred down there. Hmm. Well, I might as well check out this camp. Oh, I assume you're not friendly then. Well, that's honestly a truly a shame. Now. Stranger. Please, I don't want to complicate things too much. I'm just curious on what's in your camp. Are you? Ah. <sighs> Guess what? Oh, it shows my gold sea wolf's like health and stuff like that. That's cool. Either way, though, they're dead. Hmm. They're a good job, buddy. Hmm. Can I hear you? Oh, I can. That's cool. Hmm. Why did the music stop? Okay, it's switching. Man, there's a bunch of crusty bread. Magic imbued robes. 
Claymore Flames. Include an instruction manual with said Claymore. Hmm. Yeah, this is a bandit camp though. Yes. Shame, but... Well, shame that had to be a bandit camp right here, but... Not... Some things just can't change. But... Anyways, though... I think... It sucks to say this, but... I think it may be the end of the episode. I did say I was gonna cut down on... What else gonna be doing for this one? And I am. No, oh, oh man, the camera angle is terrible for this one. I might as well just say the usual thing. Uh, let me know what you think of the camera angle, of how I'm doing the video now. It's just gonna be shorter instead of the hour-long ones. If you like the video, please like. If you want to comment then subscribe if you really like the content and yeah let's see what happens next time will we find more about like Yo's past and things like that when we talk to Alfred uh, will we find what's in this key well watch the next episode of Ender all when it comes out and you'll see this new to gaming signing off peace